Are candy buttons actually as bad as their reputation? Let's find out in today's history, review, and autopsy of Candy Buttons. Released in the 1930s by the Cumberland Valley Company in New York, they are buttons. Made of sugar, corn syrup, and gelatin stuck to delicious, nutritious paper. And come in four flavors, cherry, lemon, lime, and paper. They were believed to have been invented by a George Theophile Dibb after he created a machine that was able to attach candy to a sheet of paper. Why did he do this? Because science has gone too far. The candy was sold to Necco in the late 70s to add to their heavy quotations, stellar line of products. But when they went bankrupt in 2018, they were saved from the fiery pits of hell from whence they came by the Doshers Candy Company, who now sells them under the Candy House brand I have here and makes them on the same equipment they were originally. And boy, do they look like it. My review? As promised, their reputation is accurate. They don't taste great, although the pink ones do taste kind of like Pepto-Bismol, which I like, but that's just because I'm a nasty little freak. Too much paper comes off with each button, which isn't pleasant to eat, but I do acknowledge their iconography as a representation of candy, so my rating is 0.3 out of 5 cavities. What would you rate these out of 5 cavities? Here are a full review of them on our Candy Review Podcast, Candy is Dandy, anywhere you get your podcasts.